We are so excited today. Yes. Um, we found out when we got into this area that this was here. Yes. The Jelly Belly Factory Tour. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um, stick around to the end and we will tell you what our favorite flavor of Jelly Belly is. Um, but while you're watching, go ahead and leave us a comment and let us know what your favorite flavor of Jelly Belly is. I'm kind of kinda hoping maybe they have, because it is the, the factory, that maybe they have something unique. Yeah, something different that you can that only find here. you don't find in all the stores. Yeah. Or candy shops. And I'm curious. Yeah, just by what we got off online was that you, there's a self-guided tour. Mm -hmm. There is a store, store. There's like a cafe. I'm probably going to buy my weight in Jelly Bean. <laughs> <laughs> and you get to taste test a lot of the jelly beans. So, yeah. and I guess the way the factory tour works is it's like a, a catwalk that goes over the top of the uh, factory so that you can walk Watch. and like look down onto them Which doing is their cool. thing. Yeah. It's, it's your own pace. Um, so, I don't know how much we're going to get to film in there. It kind of depends on what they let us do. Yeah. But hopefully, we'll be able to see some cool stuff. And we're super excited. I'm so excited. I just want to eat some jelly beans. <laughs> like this could be the highlight of my whole stay here. <laughs> <laughs> Which is crazy. Because we're doing some really cool stuff while we're here. We are. Yeah. But I mean to be at the motherland of jelly beans. Yeah, it's pretty cool. God, it's so cool. entered the tour and we got our little intro video yeah. and got a lot of information there yeah. on how they make jelly bellies yeah. it takes 7 to 14 days to make a jelly bean that's great that's great it is great yeah and uh, they did tell us they are in full production yeah we'll see it all so we'll get to see everything today right. yeah and you get to see it too <laughs> really cool so far. Yeah. I don't know if you can see that there, but all those big pallets full of jelly beans. That's big jelly beans. Huh. Those are probably the ones because they said they drop them in the molds and they sit in the molds for 24 hours. So I think those are sitting in molds right now to take their, yeah, take their bean shape and then to the tumbler. Yeah, and the tumbler is where they get like their outer layer. Their outer shell and then after that their shine. They're polished. Yeah. And then so cool. they get stamped. Every jelly bean gets stamped with the Jelly Belly logo. So hopefully we'll get to see some of the spinning outer layers being added, some of the polishing or shining, yeah. and some of the stamping. And then um, probably toward the end we'll see more of the packaging. Yeah. And also, fun fact, we're going to throw in fun facts all along the way. They make over a hundred flavors of Jelly Belly, yes. which I did not know. They made that many. Yeah. I was thinking maybe like... Well, when you get into the gourmet flavor... That's true. Oh, and then they do the um, the Harry Potter thing yeah. too, where they do like those icky flavors, like the... Uh, well, the bean boozled. Yeah, the bean, bean boozled. not been polished yet. No, they're kind of hanging out and they're going to get shined up and then they'll get stamped and packaged. 
Um, so I don't know how far along the tour we are so far, but we've seen some really cool stuff. And what's really cool are these Jelly Belly portraits. Yes, the art is phenomenal. Yeah, so they take these, you know, with tweezers, one jelly bean at a time, and some of the bigger ones they say it can be up to 15,000 jelly beans on one piece of art. And I don't know how long it takes them. I'm sure they say, but I don't know how long it takes them to do it, but it looks pretty tedious. I was very disappointed to find out that Ronald Reagan, who was, was a huge jelly bean supporter. Yeah, and everybody that stayed as a guest at the White House got, got a, jar. a jar of jelly beans. But his favorite flavor is licorice. Black licorice. My least favorite. Yeah, I don't know anybody. Well, my father. My father loves black licorice. Yeah. But most people are you put in bar. No wonder he likes my dad. He's always getting the Yeah. I'm not a fan of black licorice. But um, no. I think most of the other regular flavors I like. Yeah. yeah. Well, we've seen a lot of the production so far. Yeah. And I can't believe how many beans it is. This is a different room from where we vlogged before. Yeah. This is another one. This is actually where they add the outer shell. layer, the, the shell. shell. Yeah. yeah. And so even the windows are a little cloudy because of all the sugar dust. Sugar because they're scooping the sugar I into was these tumblers. Because like, my OCD we saw on the lighting picture, like it's cake and white and I'm like yeah. oh they don't clean up here but then I was like oh it's duh. so much sugar they are pouring just throwing yeah. sugar in there constantly to and then they it. put like the corn syrup in there to get it, to, it to get it to stick and add layers so as it's tumbling they just keep every so often add more sugar add more corn syrup and just gets that bean thicker and thicker you could just lick air and probably taste sugar oh yeah in it's insane <laughs> and it is so loud in there we're on the back side, but as soon as you get out there by the tumblers, Where it's the so loud, off. you can't, there's it no way you can talk. It sounded like when we were having the hail storm. Yeah, it was loud. the RV. We had to yell at each other to talk. Yeah, that's exactly what those drums sounded like. Yeah. It's crazy. But that is by far the most jelly beans I have ever seen <laughs> in my life. Probably the most you will ever see. Yeah, here, and now I think we're headed off to the finishing room where they get their shiny coat and get stamped with the jelly bellies. Yeah. Clear coat, they got their stamp, they're just hanging out in here. They're drying. So I overheard the, uh, I was the video you you heard it. as you were walking by. And when this is full, full. all rows full. How many jelly beans? 200 million jelly beans. Holy crap. That's ridiculous. You can't even fathom. <laughs> 200, million. 200 million jelly beans. Just sitting there. Mm -hmm. Asking to eat me. <laughs> oh my gosh. You wouldn't be able to put a dent in that, man. Well, oh, no. I, uh, but give, it's really cool to see. I give it a good army try. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, and we're not done yet. I think no. we're gonna go down and see what they got down there to, to try. Try, yeah. Uh, walk through mm -hmm. the little shop, cafe. And, shop, uh, I noticed when we came in had some unique stuff that I have not noticed in stores before. Yeah, so maybe we'll pick up something that uh, you can only get here. Yeah. We'll show you. Okay. 
Well, one of the cool parts about the tour, yeah. free jelly beans. Yeah, we each get a little assorted and then a bigger assorted. Yeah, and so I think, well, obviously you're gonna try different flavors because it's assorted. Well, yeah. But some might get spit out, but <laughs> <laughs> I'll try them. And you know, Ronald Reagan, because he used to be such a jelly bean guy, yeah. he used to say you could tell a lot about a fellow's character about whether he picks certain flavors out yeah. or if he just grabs about a handful yeah. of it, yeah. which I think is true. That, yeah, if you if you really think about it, yeah. Because I think people who just grab it's a handful so. are like a little more adventurous, a little yeah. more like... Like they take whatever they get, whatever. they don't care. And then the picky one's kind of like... Be, I would be. Yeah, it's very not, set no, in their ways. No. Like yeah. you. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're very like a one flavor jelly well, belly well, kind of guy. Well, I like like probably a handful of flavors. Like I could yeah. eat them. If they're there, I'd eat them. But if I go into a store and you got the big dispensers on the wall, yeah. I'm only buying the one flavor. bulk of one flavor. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so um, so we've tried a few now. And so like we, we told you at the end of the video, we would tell you what our favorite flavors are. Mm -hmm. And I already know what your favorite flavor is. Go ahead and say it. What is it? It's cotton candy. Cotton candy. Yeah. I knew that. Yeah. You've been eating that for years. For years. Yeah. As long as... I mean, seriously, as long as our kids have been alive, yeah. I, my go-to is cotton candy. I do like watermelon. Watermelon's good. That's and, one of my faves. This is going to sound so stupid. I've never had berry cherry. You've never had and berry it, cherry? No, and it says that the three most bought flavors, yeah. popular flavors, is berry cherry, buttered popcorn, and for some god-awful reason, the black licorice. Oh, <laughs> I don't know how that made the top three, but I've never had berry cherry. So well, I am going to go down there and try berry cherry. Okay. It smelled good in the smell station. It did smell really I good. I did smell it, but yeah. I've never physically had one. And my favorite mm -hmm. is the uh, green apple. Yeah, that is a good one. I do like the apples. Yeah, yeah they're my favorites. Yeah. But I'm more of like a grab a handful kind you of guy. Are, you are. So we have to find a very cherry. Oh, there's more than one. Okay. Very cherry. I think these are both very cherries. Cheers. <laughs> mm, no, that's not very cherry. This one tastes like fireball. Oh, you got the cinnamon? <laughs> I like the fireball got, flavor one. I do like the cinnamon. Mine was very cherry. Very good. Mine was very cinnamony. I could smell it from here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But I very good. I love red hot, so I would like cinnamon. But very good. Yeah. The one that smelled very good over there was the juicy pear. Juicy pear did in the smell station. And on the I've tour. never tried the juicy pear because I don't like pears. I don't either. But, but let's it try smelled it. phenomenal. I think this is the juicy pear. Yeah, with the speckles. Yeah, so try that. Grab you one of the juicy pears. It's actually pretty good. Pear flavor yeah. candy is good. I'm just not a pear person, but I like the flavor. You get more of the pear toward the end. The end. Yeah. It's like a tart. I'm gonna get the pear. Yeah. At the yeah. End. yeah. I couldn't eat a lot of those. No, but if you got like a variety pack, I think that that'd be it's good. It's a good flavor to have, yeah. Yeah. And then the rest of these, I guess, are just assorted flavors. Yeah, you had the sizzling cinnamon. Yeah, the cinnamon was good. Um, the, ooh, I like peach. I think this is peach. Peach is speckled. Grab that one. I speckle? think that's peach. Okay. Peach is one of my favorites. Mm, yeah. That's good. That's peach. Yeah, that's true peach. That it's like tastes, you just bit into a like, peach. Yeah, you bit into a really juicy peach. I like that. That's very good. Mm. I probably could eat a lot of those. I could eat more of those, yeah. <laughs> we hope yeah. that you enjoyed the tour. It was awesome. It was so much fun. Five dollars a person. Um, that's not where they get you. Well, no, it's the store because <laughs> you spent fifty bucks. Well, they, 
Military get a 20% discount. Yeah, so. before we go, we'll tell you all the stuff we got real quick. So I got, with the discount, it was $42. I'm still eating jelly beans. But we did get, and, and most of this is for our child. Yeah. But. Bag of the belly flops. Yeah, belly flops, which are the, the rejects. The rejects. <laughs> Misshapen, yeah. two that are merged together, yeah, too big, conjoined. too small, didn't get stamped they didn't correctly. They live up to the standard, whatever. So. But they're discounted, and they still taste good. Yeah, so. I mean, it doesn't affect the taste. It's good. And we got her some gum. Yeah, she's a gumaholic. She is so gumaholic. I'm still eating the, jelly beans. <laughs> Blueberry. And we got her the Fab Five because I don't know. She, maybe she has. Well, the cocktail ones she better not have. Um, I don't think they have alcohol. In them. <laughs> well, I know. <laughs> But the smoothies and the uh, the Cold Stone ice cream, I don't think she's had, so we got her a sample pack of that. That's like hunter orange. Yeah, that is. And mm, then orange sherbet for her boyfriend, because he likes hot sauces. Yeah, he's like a fanatic with the hot sauces, and so they had a sample bag of sriracha, jalapeno, cayenne, habanero, and Carolina Reaper. I would so, not do that. No, he'll like that. <laughs> And then I got, because she works night shift. Yeah. This might help her if they actually work. I didn't know they made these. I didn't either. But they make sport beans. I didn't know it was a thing. They have energy in them. Energy beans. Yeah. Huh. So we got the assorted pack for her to try that. And then of course we got our own. And then we got Bags ours. of beans. What is this yeah. one? If you got, would you get the apple and the watermelon? Yeah, I got the apple and watermelon mix. mix. Oh. Oops, sorry. And then I okay, went. I it. Straight up cotton candy. Yeah. I'm gonna have to pace myself. Mm, got another fireball one. I did. Because <laughs> if I don't pace myself, you'll eat the whole bag. Well, we'll be back before we leave, and I'll have to get a whole <laughs> other bag to take on the road. <laughs> I'm gonna try and pace myself. And you know, we could have come on the weekend because we're doing Candy Palooza this weekend. Yes. But it's gonna be a crazy house. Yes, I couldn't imagine what it's gonna be like. So we here. figured we would come while it was not super busy. No, because on the weekend, there's gonna be just kids everywhere. They're gonna have carnival rides out here. They're gonna have other candy vendors out in the parking lot. And so I don't be a know whole big that thing. the, the um, factory would be in full production during that too. Probably not. So we wouldn't have not. seen as much as we yeah. saw today. Because they said, you're in luck, we're in full production today, so. Yeah, so definitely, um, they said that they're in more, mm -hmm. more production during the week. Yes. So if you come during the week, you'll be able to see more. Mm -hmm. If you come on the weekend, you'll still get to see some stuff, but it's they really more like... They might not be running every section exactly. like they were today. But they were running everything today. It was awesome yeah. to see. So Five bucks to get Five in. Bucks. 50 bucks for all the crap we see. <laughs> <laughs> but it doesn't have to be a $60 it don't have adventure. To be. It could be a $10 <laughs> adventure. It could. We made it a $60 so, yeah. adventure. <laughs> well, <God. laughs> definitely let us know what your favorite flavor of Jelly Belly is. Yeah. And... Um, we recommend the tour if you're in the, it's pretty close to Sacramento, not too far away. Not it's far. in Fairfield, which is about at a 40 minute drive from Sacramento, yeah. probably about a 40 minute For drive from San Francisco. We're saying it was only a 15, 20 minute drive. Yeah, so. we're out of Travis Air Force Base, so only 15, right. 20 minutes yeah. for us. So not terrible at all. No. It's kind of nestled right there between Sacramento and San Francisco. So if you're in any of those areas, it's worth the drive out and yeah. see it. Yeah. And like we do at the end of all of our videos, mm -hmm. we're going to honor a fallen hero. If you want to get involved with helping us, help veterans, everything you need to know is down in the description of the video. Come see the Jelly Belly Factory. <laughs> That's right. Appreciate you watching. We'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.